This will be an unboxing of the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus. We do get a blue pen this year with the Aura Glow colorway. Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus on the side, on the bottom. You can pause the video if you want to read that. Unlocked by Samsung, this is the US North American variant. Snapdragon 855, 12 gigs of RAM on this bad boy. Info right there, etc. On the bottom, check that out. Let's see, where's the seal? Take my blade and we'll just make a cut and we'll dive in. So you can see. Oh, ho, 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 ho. there's the phone. Very nice. Got this little tab here. I'm gonna grab it and we'll check it out from the front. Nice and big slab of Gorilla Glass 6. So hot. We'll flip the phone over. Ooh! I gotta say, man, this Aura Glow colorway, man, that is sick. Iridescent, oil slick, the unicorn, call it whatever you want. This is sick. Woo! Love it, man. You can see the triple camera setup on the back, etc. Although, in my opinion, I think they could have gone more of uh, a horizontal layout. This kind of copies the iPhone, the Huawei P30, etc. but whatever. It's all good. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the phone. Almost forgot. The button's on the left side of the phone now, so you can see. Put that to the side. We'll go through the rest of the packaging. Little card here, put that to the side. And in here we get this new 25 watt fast charger. So you can see the USB type C input. And then what do we got? I'm gonna try to get in here. Read that if you want. Put that to the side and we got a pair of AKG earbuds. These are type C now. Phone making noises, which is good, but that's annoying. I'm gonna turn that off for now. And then back to the earbuds. These are USB type C. I'm not gonna take it out. You can take my word for it. And then in here, we get the USB cable to charge your device. Put that to the side. And then in here, what's in here? Aha! We got your little adapter here to transfer information. Put that to the side and let's see, I think that's all in the box. Now, if I'm, aha, see? Samsung trying to be sneaky with the box. I knew there was something missing. We'll uh, just take a quick look at this one. Uh, USB type, or not the USB type C. Haha, <laughs> the um, whatchamacallit this thing? The uh, the SIM ejaculation tool. I'm just kidding, SIM ejector. Although you can call it SIM ejaculation if you want. And what is this? This device is packaged with a screen protector. Aha, this is interesting. Uh, letting you know that the phone has a screen protector now. From that old Galaxy Fold fiasco with the screen protector. I want to make sure that you know it has a screen protector already. Put that to the side. And then what's in here? The booklets and stuff, right? I want to read the pamphlets. Where's the pamphlets and stuff? Okay, what's going on here? Why is this so hard to take off? What the heck, dude? Okay, here we go. Reference guide. Transfer what's important, terms and conditions, etc. Nobody reads that stuff. And that's it. Put all this to the side and... This is what I want to see. Moment of silence, please. Woo! Amazing. Gotta look at this colorway again, man. This is sick. Very nice. See if I can get the light to hit it at a certain... See the light right there. See all the different colors. The unicorn! All right, let's breeze through the setup really quickly. English, let's go. Insert a SIM card. We'll do that later. And what is this? Just gonna click on one. Next. Oh, gotta click on two of them. Okay, next. Bring your old data. We'll skip the data stuff for now. Skip. And then we'll go ahead and log in my Wi-Fi. Checking for updates. Let me know in the comments what you think of the whole punch camera, right? Smack dab in the middle. Definitely interesting design choice. Or do you prefer it being on the side like the S10, S10 Plus? Let me know in the comments below. Or like the OnePlus 7 Pro, do you prefer no notch?
let me know. Go through the phone really quickly. Over here you have your power button slash Bixby button now, all in one button, volume rocker, and then on this side of the phone is clean AF now. On the bottom, you do not have a headphone jack, SMH, mic, USB Type-C speaker, and the S Pen, of course, so you can see. This would not be a note without the pen. We'll check that out in a little bit, but for now, let's put it back in the phone. And on top, you have your SIM tray, and then you have a mic, and I don't know what that is. Not an IR blaster, I think that has something to do with the speaker. And let's see, what am I missing? On the back, you have your triple camera setup, as you can see, time of flight sensor, flash. Check that out. And then, I just noticed this. It no longer says what the phone is on the bottom. Like on the S10 Plus, it says Galaxy S10 here. On the Note, it says Note 9. This one doesn't say it anymore. So, a little bit of a cleaner look. I like it. Everybody knows this is a Note device. Don't need to say it. Here we go. We'll just go ahead and skip the login stuff. We'll skip. Skip. I want to do the fingerprints. I want to check out this new ultrasonic scanner. Now, I'll be honest, the ultrasonic scanner on the S10 Plus wasn't the best in my opinion. Didn't always recognize my fingerprint. So we'll go ahead and just do a pattern here. So everybody can get in my phone. We'll confirm that real quick. And then here we go. Scan your fingerprint. So let's get started with this. Press a little harder. 26%, 32%. 39%, 46%, 51%, 55. Hundred percent fingerprint added. All right, wasn't too bad, next. Samsung account, we'll skip that later. All done, finish. Making the usual Samsung noises, which is good. And we are in. All right, let's check out the Android we get. We'll go to about phone real quick, and then we'll go to software information. And as you can see, Android version nine. And I think there should be already an OTA here based on what I've read that should be coming soon with the August security patch as of this video. We'll go ahead and look at the storage as well. This is a 256 gig model. And out of the box, we'll click on storage. You get, 32.7 gigs are used out of the 256. So you do the math, that's how much you have available. Very nice. Screen is a screen is a 1440p dynamic AMOLED model. And first impressions is that it looks gorgeous, man. Very nice display. Really interested in the camera. So we'll just take a picture of something. Let's see. Take a picture of huh, my battery here. And we'll just uh, go ahead and do it like this. And we'll go to 2x optical zoom, get nice and close, and we'll go ultra wide so you can see. Boom, I'll put that in the video so you can check it out. So I wanna try out the text recognition. So I'm gonna go ahead and create a note here. I'm just gonna say note 10 plus. As you can see, and I'm gonna click on this little cloud icon, and then this enables you to select an area of your note. So I'm gonna go ahead and select that right there, so you can see, and then uh, click on this, extract text, and if it did it correctly, it says, well, this one says none 10 plus. So maybe not 100% accurate, but pretty cool feature if you wanna convert your uh, notes into text. And if it does make a mistake, just go in there and then just do that. It says Note 10 Plus. Pretty cool feature overall, I like it. So let's compare the Note 10 Plus to some other devices and then we'll run off the video nicely. Here it is against the uh, S10 Plus from earlier this year. As you can see, Note 10 Plus, a little bit bigger in size overall. Take a quick look at that. Longer, wider. Might be the thinner phone though. That's debatable. 
so you can see that color though unicorn Woo! and then we'll compare it real quick to last year's note 9 so they're about the same size overall note 10 might be a little bit taller actually that's about the same to me we'll look at the front very similar on the sides similar thickness note 10 might be a little bit thinner but if you compare the bodies real quick essentially the same size but the note 10 has a 6.8 inch display this one 6.4 they really minimized the bezels on the note 10 look at the screens i love it so let me know in the comments below what you want me to do with the samsung galaxy note 10 plus speed tests camera tests durability tests etc versus iphone tennis max Galaxy Note 9 from last year, the S10 Plus, Huawei P30 Pro, the OnePlus 7 Pro. Thanks for watching. Peace out.